Good evening everyone, and welcome to the stream. So back with some more Final Fantasy 3 this evening. Hopefully we can uh, continue on with the story. Kind of pretty much, um, I spent a little bit of time today trying to catch up with uh, any treasure chest that I was missing. Because uh, I got myself to a, like, a checkpoint where you can uh, check from this particular guide. I seem to have one chest missing <laughs> somewhere. Oh, I have, I've gone back through all the dungeons and I couldn't find that one chest anywhere, so I'm not hoping there's a slight mistake in the guide and that I haven't missed a chest, but anyway, we shall see. Hey Marta, how are you doing? Hope you're good. Alright, so uh, yeah, this is the next place we need to, we need to visit. The forbidden food. There's no chocobos here. I'm telling you, honest. And there's no chocobos in my airship either. Not even... Uh, not even fat ones. Actually, that's weird. It smells like chocobo, does it? It's not really a chocobo there. All right, so we've got this place here to visit. Falgabard, Falgabard. Oh, we've got a dark night here. Looks like <laughs> someone got caught telling a fib. I didn't see a chocobo. Did you see a chocobo? I didn't see a chocobo. Oh, it looks like a whole town full of dark knights. Welcome to Fulgabard, the place where solace for those who seek to train in the way of the dark blade. Dark blades can only be wielded by those who have managed to overcome the darkness within. Dark knights excel at using them. Oh, we have a, a moogle. Do we have any mail? Yes, finally. Now that we've got this letter from Sid, we can actually do the um, the quest for the ultimate weapon. I've been waiting for this letter from Sid. Something in the basement. Mrs. Sid came running up from the basement today, all scared like. She says she saw something big lurking in the shadows. I hope we don't have a monster down there. So I guess we need to go and help Sid out with um, whatever that problem is. <laughs> hey, Mytho, how are you doing? You don't see chocobos after my Final Fantasy fourteen thick chocobo. <laughs> yeah, that was the um what's the proper name for it? Fat chocobo. <laughs> yeah, I have a fat chocobo on my airship, although he seems to be invisible for some reason, I don't know why. The legendary blade, Mazamun, has been lost for ages, but I hear it lies in its hidden resting place, waiting for a true master to claim it. In ancient times, there were soldiers who fought with dark blades, and by throwing weapons with tremendous power, they were called ninja. The monsters that roam inside the Cave of Shadows, north of Amar, can only be defeated by dark blade techniques. Many venture in, but none return. I heard that some monsters will divide and multiply if you attack them normally. Talk about doubling your trouble. Yeah, I don't get this whole divide and multiply. They use the skill divide and they multiply. And they use the skill multiply and they multiply. I don't know. Seems to be both exactly the same thing to me. The beasts that roam in this cave can only be defeated by an adept of the Dark Blade. You don't stand a chance. I don't like the sound of that. Right, what's over here? We'll check out the shops in a minute. Oh, nothing here? Right, let's have a look then. Magic shop. What do you have for me? <laughs> Divide and multiply. They be doing the Rona move? 
Right, let's have a look. We have... I uh, We have these, we have this, and this, and yeah, we have all of these. Okay, so we don't need to buy anything in here. Let's check the armoury. Ooh! Demon mail and a demon shield. I've been pretty much getting them to double uh, dual wield the whole time, so I'm not going to bother buying a shield, but I am going to get at least one of the... How much is two? Oh, I suppose I could get two. Let's equip those, and then we'll see about weapons. I feel like we only just got um, upgrades. Where's this demon now? Oh, there we go. Nice helm, why is he wearing that? Seriously, that's not the best he's got. That's not very good. That's like from right in the beginning of the game. Yeah, I, I got you, Mytho. <laughs> uh... I think that's the best um, best weapons. Yeah, I think we're good. Yeah, let's have a look. Let's see um, what's in the um, weapon shop. Ooh, Ashura. Effective against dividing enemies. I like the sound of that. I guess we're going to need to get two of those then. Or at least one. I guess we can get two. We only just got those other ones. I feel like you just get a new weapon and then you come to a shop and it's got something better and you have to spend all your money. Who's this for? Demon axe. Oh, I guess we need some of those. That's like nearly all my money. <laughs> Okay, let's um, change the weapons. Sure, that's the one. Cross protect. I'm not really bothered too much about that. Just been kind of pretty much brute forcing my way through the game so far. I haven't really um, been using too much of their uh, <laughs> of their special moves. Right, I think we're good as far as weapons go. I guess we should um, go to the inn. It's really expensive. It's only up 200, it's like 640. What a rip off. Oh, forgot to start off the uh, stream raiders. So let's do that. Hopefully, it should be working okay this evening. I've kind of lowered the settings again, and I, I, um, I've not been getting any dropped frame notices today, so I think we should be good. click back on the other monitor. <laughs> oh, my controller doesn't work. Right, do we need anything from here? Maybe a few potions. Just to make sure. Could do with one of those. Yeah, I think we're good. Right, I don't know if we're meant to go in this cave just yet. I'm going to save my game first. I 
we just check the um, the guide because I keep I keep missing out bits and forgetting things and so I'm just going to keep looking at the guide just to make sure I'm going to the right place. Right, so we did the ancient ruins. So we're at Forgabard. Okay, so apparently we're meant to ignore the old man in the cave for now. Apparently there's some place um, behind the waterfall. Okay, let's go and look for that then. one who is worthy of wielding this blade. Let us test your metal. <laughs> hey Temp, how are you doing? Yeah, Mytho it is. It's a nag bot. It's especially for nagging Mytho. <laughs> it's especially to nag you. Right, let's see. I hope this is not too difficult. I'm not too bad, Temp, thank you. Um, glad to get back to this game. It's been giving me a bit of, a bit of trouble. But hopefully we should be good now. Right, I have no clue uh, what I'm doing with this, this boss at all. Uh, I'm guessing, really, he should be provoking to keep... To keep uh, Keep it off everyone else. Let's summon... Oh, I don't know who... Go for this one to start off with. Let's do a Soul Eater and she can sing because that just tops everyone up. We haven't got a dedicated healer in the party right now but um, the Bard just um, has like, like the sing ability is like free. It doesn't cost any MP so we can just keep spamming that. Did I figure out the GPU issue? No. Well, it seems to be okay today. I've got everything running that I would normally have running. And um, let me just check. I've been keeping an eye on it. It's at uh, 65%. Um, I don't know. DC! <laughs> Thank you so much for the resub. How are you doing? I hope you're good. I know, four months already, it's crazy. Right, I was too busy looking at everything else and um, in the chat and other things. I didn't see anything of that last round. I have no idea what the summon cast did or, oh yeah, I have no clue what's going on. Um, so yeah, I feel like we're starting around again. <laughs> I don't know if anything did any damage or not. Summon again, let's go for, I don't know, let's try Titan. I don't even know what any of these, I, I need to look up these um, summons to find out what they do because it seems to be a bit random. Yeah, she can sing. Have a good, uh, have a good uh, day at work, um, DC. Oh my goodness. Clobber? What is this? Oh, that didn't do very much damage. I think my Dragoon's back. Oh, there we go. We're good anyway. That was a close one there for Ingus. Truly a battle of extraordinary magnitude. 
You have proven yourselves worthy to wield this blade. Use it well. Right, so I just spent money on new weapons, and now you're going to give me another. What is it? The Kiku Ichim Mun... Oh, yeah, I have no idea how you pronounce that. Maybe it's a ninja blade. It sounds more like a... I don't know. Let's have a look. Who's that for? Here we go. Oh, see, look, I just wasted my money. <laughs> And now I've got a new effective against dividing enemies. Another one effective against dividing enemies. I just spent all that money. Oh. It's a katana in Final Fantasy XII, is it? They use the um the names in a lot of um you know, they re they reuse everything. They recycle in Final Fantasy. They like to recycle. That was uh, faster than I was expecting actually. Right. fixing this up. There we go. Have you got anything else to say? Open yourself to your fear. Only then will darkness grant you its power. Don't really know what that means. Is Inga still as good as Arme? I don't know. Could he ever be that good? Right, what's down here? Ooh. Oh, I feel like this should be something here. Like that's kind of very uh, anticlimactical. There, sh there, there should be like a sword in that rock or something. I don't know. It feels like something should be there. Can I get under here? In there? No. What is this all about then? Seriously? Am I missing something here? Let me quickly have a look at the guide. I feel like I'm having to use the guide a lot for this game. Okay, boss Shinobi, we did that. Uh, hold on, it doesn't say... It doesn't say anything about the... about this um, rock. Oh, here we go. Hold on. Here we go. It looked like there ought to be stuff there. Nice. Right, so I just bought the demon mail. <laughs> Keep doing this. So I bought two of those. Oh, I don't know, what else did I pick up? Hammer, so that would be for the Viking. Let's just. I just bought two new weapons as well. I just wish I'd waited now. Uh, let's have a look. Yeah, that's a better one. Let's equip that. So it says the other cave is optional. We may as well um, go in there, I guess. I'm going to save first before we go in there. Uh, this place is like 
Oh, another glittered hammer. So I just completely wasted my money then. As usual. There we go. I was going to say, we haven't got a single uh, random encounter so far in here. So hopefully this shouldn't be too difficult. We should be able to just... Um... Auto fight. You saw what? More demon mail. This would be great if I wanted them all to be um, Dark Knights, I guess. Uh, which way? There we go. That's probably it. Right, let's get out of here then. Stop here. Right, I think that's it. Keep for here. Let's just save it again. Right, let's have a look and see where we need to go next. Okay, so we've got more optional things. We can do um, some of the uh, summons. We can do Leviathan and um, 
Bahamut. I have no idea if we're strong enough to, do, to fight them yet, but um, we could always give it a try. So for Leviathan, we need to go back to the floating continent. Yeah, let's go, and, let's go and try that and see if we can find um, Leviathan next. So yeah, we've got a shiny new airship, which um, can travel over low mountains. <laughs> Still not the big ones. It's a bit slower than the other airship though. Where are we? Oh, it's going south. So there's a lake somewhere that, ah, oh, that's it, look there, with a shadow in it. So that, I think, is Leviathan. So we need to, oh, I think we can just um, go across here. We just go across the lake. Or do we need? Hmm. Oh, here, here we go. Lake door. This is it. Oh, there are also monsters in here that are missable. So I probably should check the vestry as well. Okay, so these particular enemies cannot be encountered after leaving the dungeon, after defeating Leviathan. So let's check those, 140, 141 and 142. Okay, so I think the ones we just defeated was 140. So there's just three different types that we need to make sure we uh, fight. So we've got the red floaty thingy, like a blue thing that almost looks like a blue lion's head. I don't know, it's kind of weird looking. And then a big blobby sea anemone, sea anemone type thing. So yeah, that's, that's the three enemies we're looking for. <laughs> Oh, lots of loot, that's what we like to see. When they give you lots of high potions, <laughs> be afraid. <laughs> be very afraid.
So we need to make sure we encounter all of those three monsters before we um, take on the boss. Last chest. So I hope this exit doesn't go directly into the boss room. So we need to not go to the boss straight away. We need to make sure we get enemies first for the best jury. Okay, these are the blobby sea and enemy type of things. So I think that's two we've got so far that we need. There's just one more enemy. This is the ones that we've seen already, so we still need that third monster type. Weird looking crab claw things. Make sure there's nothing else up the top first before we go down there. Is this the yeah, the things that looks kind of like a lion head. Yeah, this is what we need. That's it. We should be good for the best area now. Slightly damage. I guess the fire then being a water creature might be susceptible to thunder. Maybe we should equip one of those. It's only one, one less. Hold on, no, hang on. Let me just check. Uh, dragon. No, what have we got? We've got the lesser hammer. Where is that? One hundred and twenty. And how much is this one? Hundred and fifteen. Hmm. I don't know. Let's just leave that for now.
More loot, a black hole. What that does? Another hammer. I wonder if we should really. I know that um, the armor that we're wearing now is stronger, but I'm thinking maybe we should use the reflect now because I think it um, it's got status ailments. I think that might be beneficial when fighting the Viper. How much protection it gives you, it doesn't really say. Protects against some status ailments. I don't know. Let's, uh, let's equip it and hope for the best, I guess. Can he not? He can't wear it. Who else can? I think maybe, um, Lunith's the only one. Yeah. Okay, well if we've got one protected against status elements then um, they can <laughs> hopefully sort the rest out with their stuff from the um, item list I guess. I missed the... Um Stream Raiders. Oh no, it was just about. <laughs> Still got a few seconds left. Feels like it's been longer than half an hour. The stream raiders. Right, here we go. Oh dear, <laughs> it didn't go too well. Let's try that one again, shall we? Give me two different directions. I don't know which one to go. <laughs> go down. Let's 
good job we have the bard, I think, in this area. So I feel like if I was having to use MP to heal or potions, I would run out by now. I feel like I want to go back and see what the other path where that was going. So I don't think we can come back here once we've um, fought Leviathan, so I need to make sure I get everything. I don't know if it's just my imagination, but there seems to be more um, frequent battles than usual in this dungeon. Oh, we came this way. I'm really confused now. He's the only one that had the reflect mail on and he's asleep. Oh, not good that did. Perhaps it allows him to wake up quicker, I don't know. Okay, it feels like there were two passages going to the same place, perhaps. Oh, 
Oh, I did miss a couple of chests here. Let's uh, take off the auto battle uh, first. Right, here we go, boss time. I am Leviathan, only those strong in the light may receive my aid. Let us test the light within you. <laughs> Leviathan attacks you. Mm, I don't know. Let's use maybe... Titan has a defensive move, so if we're lucky, he might use that. Uh, so let's go for Soul Eater. I think that's probably his best move, and then we're just gonna keep singing to uh, top up HP, I guess. Okay, he hits really hard. Okay, that's not what I wanted. Wow, the Viking does some nice damage. Uh, let's go for um, Rano this time. So I saw he didn't even do that much. Let's see what his normal attack does. Mind Blast! We're not getting very good luck with the uh, summons here. <laughs> yeah, he does more damage with his normal attack than his soul eater. I think his hit points, so they have to be higher to use soul eater, maybe. Let's try Ramu again. I hope we get a, an offensive spell this time. Thunderstorm, that sounds better. Yeah, that's a bit better. There we go. <laughs> Let's 
Your light is indeed strong. I am at your service. Okay, so a uh, summoner can, well, a voker can now summon um, Leviathan, I guess. So we need to equip that. There we go. Okay, let's. I did buy one of those things to teleport us out of here. But where is it? Really expensive. <laughs> where is it? It's normally at the top. Oh, here we go. I'll just run. Oh, actually, I probably should have saved it after doing that fight. Uh, I think I should probably save it in a different spot, just in case we missed anything. I think we can go back to the first one now. Right, let's see, where do we need to go next? So, uh, Bahamut, so I thought that's back by where that mountain was, where we, uh, where he threw us off before, isn't it? I think that's where we need to go. Yeah, and we had to run away from him. Um, but we can't go back to where he was, because when you go back up that hill, he's not there anymore. So apparently we need to go to Tazus, which is southeast of Canaan. Right, let's go and have a look. There's the tower, so Canon okay, will be down here across the castle somewhere. That's Canon. Southeast. Maybe it's maybe here, maybe this is where we need to go. Alright, I can't get across there. Get to Bahamut's lair, head back to Tuzus, which is southeast of Canaan. Pretty sure this is Canaan. Let me just check. It is. We perhaps also need to see Sid anyway because uh, we had that letter from him and it's um, something to do with the ultimate weapon, the ultimate weapon. Oh, nice of you to come. As you know, a monster has set up permanent residence in our basement. Of course, if I were a bit younger, I'd take care of things by the business end of a rusty wrench. <laughs> Too bad that these days even putting on my socks is enough physical exertion for a good 24 hours. Good old Sid. Anywho, that's where you come in. Could you take a look at what's down there? Me and the missus, we will be mighty grateful. Okie dokie.
Where's this thing? Look there. Prepare to be exterminated. Leviathan, shall we? Demon Eye? What does this do? Whoa, insta death. That's pretty awesome. this well that was that <laughs> look there's something on the floor oh it's our calcum i've never seen metal like this mentioned in any books before we obtained the unknown metal so we need to go and find the um the uh the woman that We'll build the weapon. We've already spoken to her. Um, I think she travels around the place, so you have to kind of go to lots of different places to try and find her. Your basement certified pest free, Sid. Splendid. I hope excessive force was utilised. What's that you're carrying there? It's a piece of metal that the monster dropped. Well, I'll be. Here's sorry, Calcum. A very rare metal indeed. There's only a handful of smiths in the world who could temper it. It's even out of Tucker's League. Actually, we know someone who might be interested in this. Oh, so? Already making connections, eh? Anywho, thanks for dropping by to help us. And good luck on your journey. Right. Uh, let's see if we can find uh, the hammer. Let's uh, save again. So it's meant to be southeast from here. That doesn't didn't seem to be anywhere southeast. Town, though, this is not a town. Oh, the Hermit's Lair. Well, there wasn't any town there. I don't know, that didn't make any sense at all. Okay, let's see if we can find him. area first.
Alright, onwards, onwards. Where is Bahamut? More loot. chest. So we seem to be okay with um, Leviathan, so I'm hoping we should be fine also with uh, the hammer. Wrath? I wonder what that does. Maybe you want to use it on Marta, huh? Oh, let me, let's I mean if we sort first. Chocobo's wrath. What is that? Creates an inferno. Mm. <laughs> hey Stealthy, how are you doing? More treasure. I think we must be close to the, the hammock now. How are you doing today, Stealthy? Gaming before work? So are you doing like a later shift today? Because it must be afternoon where you are. Night shift. What are you playing at the moment? Oh, here we go. Are you strong enough to defeat me? Oh, I really hope so. What? Oh. I thought he kicked me out. He kicked me out of his lair. Oh no, we've still got auto on. <laughs> Oops. Oh, he's yeah, still playing last epoch. <gasps> Ooh. Has he got some kind of retaliate? Uh, let's attack. Let's summon. Oh, I don't know. Who do we want? Let's try and revive then again. We can attack. She needs to sing. Just sing for your life. <laughs> Demonize this. I don't think this is going to one shot for Hannah, surely. Miss. Yeah, I didn't think it would work on him.
Uh, let's go for... I don't know. Ifrit, maybe? much. Better than nothing, I suppose. <gasps> Mega Flare. Okay, now I'm scared. Oh! That, 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 that was nasty. So does that mean if I make another character a summoner, they can summon any of those that I've talk to the other character you have to have the spell equipped so if there's only one spell available only one person can equip it if that makes sense uh temp i think they all need to heal uh... you can sing Oh my goodness, I don't even know if that's going to heal them enough. <laughs> hey Panda, how are you doing? You can unequip, you can unequip, you can give them to other people, but you can't, uh, two people can't have the same spell at the same time if there's only one copy of it, if that makes sense. same person twice oh my goodness uh, I don't know I don't know who's good on Bahamut none of these seem to be doing that much damage let's try Odin yeah I'm pretty good thanks Panda Nice to be back with some Final Fantasy 3 again. I want to get this game finished now. I feel like it's been taking rather a long time to get through it, but it's because I've been faffing around trying to 100% um, certain aspects of it, and it's it's been starting to annoy me, actually. <laughs> okay, Odin did hmm, not too bad, David, I suppose. Mega Flare. Oh no! No, 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 Bahamut, that's does that's not allowed. Oh my goodness. We're in really bad shape now. He's gonna. He always hits twice every round, so he's probably gonna one-shot these guys now. Mega flare. Oh, okay, that's it. We dead. That's all right. <laughs> the party has been defeated. Oh dear. Did I save it before I went in there? I can't remember when I saved it. I'm pretty sure I did. Yeah, I saved it just after coming out from there, so... Let's go into the stream, Raiders! After that, uh... Yeah, we, got, we get defeated in stream, Raiders, then Bahamut kicks our ass, And, uh, I don't know, are we gonna, how are we gonna do with the stream, Raiders? Alright, I think, uh... Temp has been placing epic units, so hopefully we might be alright. Right, if we go. Okay, Panda.
Oh, this is not looking good either. <laughs> again. Yeah, we're not doing too too well today. So this is our last try. We've run out of retry tokens now. Right, so should we try Bahama again or do we need to, do we think we need to level up more? I don't know. I guess we could give it another go and if, if we can't do it we can always come back because these are only meant to be optional right now anyway, they're not, we don't have to do them. Right, let's just save it here so we don't have to do that, I know it's only a short journey. So um, maybe we could try using, sometimes the, um, the things you get, the items that you pick up, there were quite a few items we picked up in those chests on the way here. So sometimes they'd end up doing more damage than, um, than your magic. Oh, we've got to pick all these up again. So we've got Heavenly Wrath, we've got Earthen Drums, I think that might do some maybe earth damage. We've also got that Chocobo Wrath, which will be in one of the other ones coming up, I guess. Maybe we should try using those. See what happens. Also, I think if we just make sure uh, we don't let the hit points get too low, we keep them topped up a bit better with high potions as well as singing, maybe that might work better.
Oh, I seem to be petrified. Let's remove that. Is it just across here, or...? <laughs> can't remember where he was. <laughs> I want to take off the... Ah, oh, it's too late. <laughs> I want to take off the auto fight first. Right, I'm just quick. I think I um, actually needed to heal up first as well. Use a high potion first. Right, let's try some of these things we have in here. Tense lightning damage. Dragon drums, what does that do? Creates an earthquake. Black hole. Creates a rift to another dimension. Black musk, what's that? Causes instant K, that's not going to work on him. Sheep away. It's a tornado. It's that chocobo one. Don't see it now. That one. Because we got it from the cave, it makes me feel like we should be using that. Where is it? Have I gone past it? Here now. Where is it? That's really weird. We definitely picked it up, didn't we, the chocolate over? Can't see it now. Oh, here we go, right at the bottom. <laughs> oh, I think it did 3k, it wasn't like huge amounts of damage. We got. Let's try Heavenly Wrath. Okay, this might be helpful.
I don't know if it protects against physical or magic attacks. I think it's probably like a magical attack. Oh, that did nothing. Uh, let's just attack. And summon. Don't go here this time. Let's try Odin again. I need to make dinner at the same time. Not the best idea, Panda. Don't burn your dinner because you're watching Twitch. Oh, Mega Flare. high potions don't really do that much. Maybe I should be using the elixir or something here instead. Maybe that would do a lot more. I wonder if that does the whole party. I don't know. Oh no, not Mega Flare again! Oh! That's a wipe. Oh my goodness. Well, that didn't go any better than the first time. Right, maybe we'll come back to this one. <laughs> oh yeah, you have to be careful when you're boiling milk, Panda. You don't want that to um, boil over. Right, so if we're not doing <laughs> a hammock right now, uh, what are we going to do next? Okay, so apparently Cave of Shadows is next. We need to... the central part of the eastern continent so we need to go back to um, back to the other the main continent rather than the floating island which is where we are now somewhere in the centre apparently. We'll have a look over there. Here. 
Hey Quantum, how are you doing? Oh! Okay, maybe that's not the right place. See what it says. How do we get there? Okay, it says you should pass over a desert and an oasis. That's where we are here. Then see a small mountain pass. Jump over the mountains to the west to enter the mountain maze. I don't know what he means by that. I don't know, there didn't seem to be anything west apart from that area that wouldn't let us pass. I don't think this is it. I can't go this way. Maybe this, maybe this is what they mean by mountain maze. Maybe west is wrong direction. Oh, we actually got a attacked on the airship. That doesn't happen very often. How are you, Quantum? How's your day been? This looks like it might be considered a mountain maze. Yeah, this is not west of the oasis, it's east. Don't know where what whoever wrote the guide was thinking. Uh, don't know how I'm going to get over there though. <laughs> Can't get that way. Here we go. OK, 
King of Shadows, okay. Let's uh let's just save. Before we go in there. I've come here from Folgabard for further training. Some monsters in this cave divide and multiply when attacked by normal means. Oh, I think we have weapons to um counteract that. Should be okay. My internet's fine, Quantum. I don't think it was my internet that was a problem. Well, I don't know, to be honest. But, um, yeah, everything seems to be okay today. I haven't been dropping any frames or anything. I haven't had any messages so far from, no, from Streamlabs. I did reduce all the settings for, um, Stream Raiders. That may have made a difference, I don't know. too good. It seems my dark blade was too weak, but it may have been my destiny to be here and meet you. Take this with you if you wish to venture forth. I already got these. I think. Are you sure? Or maybe not. Two now, okay. You burnt your mac and cheese, Panda. Your disappointment is immeasurable and your day has been ruined. Were you cooking it on the hob or in the oven? Maybe you can, um, you know, just don't, if it's on the hob, don't scrape the burnt stuff from the bottom and mix it in, because then usually whatever's on top will taste okay. Sad, you have to scrub the pot. Yeah. Ah, how do we get there? No, I want the chest. Let me in there. Hmm. Is there nothing in here? How do I get the one up there? Maybe I'll get there eventually. Uh, that feels like there should be something in there. Maybe there's a secret passage near the entrance? We went through quite a few secret passages already. Don't know, we might have to go back and have a look if um, we can't find it. And this, what is this? This feels like... I mean... Why does it lead to nowhere? It doesn't make... Any sense? Oops. 
I'm hoping if we just continue we might find our way to it. The encounters remind you of Pokemon. Yeah, it's old school random encounters are always like this, aren't they? Should be something in in here, or I don't know. Maybe not. I think I'm missing something. Which way did I come in? Now I'm completely disorientated. Come in that way. Okay, this is weirding me out. What, what is the point of this? I feel like I'm going the wrong way now. I've completely lost my sense of direction. Yeah, this is the way we came. Really confused. We already came. Oh, okay. This is different. Oh, look, is this the brim? 
Did we sort or did that other one have two chests in it? I don't remember now. <laughs> Reminds you of Pokemon even more. Yeah, it certainly is like a maze. Right, let's just uh, quickly do the stream raids for the third time. I think it's the third time. Third time lucky, maybe? Right, good luck everyone. Doing better this time. There we go, got there in the end. Well done, everyone. Dungeon. Uh, no, I just came this way, didn't I? This is where I look. I <laughs> my sense of direction is bad at the best of the times, and then when I swap from one screen to another to do something else, then I completely forget where I am. like you panda yeah i get lost very easy in, in, in games if i don't have a map to follow am i going back the way i came i'm really really lost now I feel like I've gone backwards.
I really hope I'm going the right way. Now you see, I feel like I've got to go backwards. This feels like the bit we were at earlier. We could be here sometime. Dust quantum. It's um, it's just all secret passages everywhere, and I and everywhere looks the same, and I'm completely lost now. Oh look, someone new. <laughs> we must be going the right way now. Who's that for? Too many options. It's too many paths. Okay, this looks like we might be near the boss. So you guess I missed the Genji armor. Yeah, I didn't see anything. So I, yeah, I guess I must have done. If there was um, Genji armor in here. I can always seek it out later. If, uh, I'll, I'll have a look and see if there was an armor. All right, who we got to fight now? Shadow attacks you. Oh, take that off. This guy's huge. Surely he can't be as bad as Bahamut's fight, though. Start off with. Gilgamesh? It could be, I don't know. I haven't got um, a scholar, so I can't use the scan thing. Oh, it was a uh, Hecaton Chier. If that's how you pronounce it, I don't know. Uh, summon. Smith and Leviathan. Let's try out Soul Eater. I don't think he's got enough hit points ready to be using that. Summon. 
cyclone. What's this do? Mm, that was not bad. <laughs> How is he 90 feet tall? I don't know. He was a bit of a giant. I think uh, I think the Hecaton Chier is meant to be a, it's a, probably a giant from mythology because I remember in lots of the other Final Fantasy games um, I think in uh, eleven they were like um, Hecaton Chier was one of the notorious monster Gygas giant things so I think it must be some kind of giant from legend. Okay, so it says we have to go back to Doga's Manor. Right. Oh, I haven't got anything. No, I haven't got anything to um to escape with. I think I used the last otter shroom in the in the last place. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try changing jobs, but. I Sometimes when I do this, I end up having no magic points, and then I can't cast teleport anyway. Uh, let's see which job. I can't remember which one I gave the teleport to. Did I give it to Rafia? Don't remember who's got it. Oh. Okay. So. Change to a red mage, I guess. Got a feeling that he's going to have no magic and I won't be able to use it. Oh, he has. That's okay. That's phew. <laughs> There's been some times when I've changed their job and uh, they've had no MP. Don't know why that is. Change his job back. Hecatonchier is an Eidolon in Final Fantasy, is that 13? But he didn't look like that. Yeah, it's also um, No Choice Monster in 11. I, I can't remember all the whereabouts in the game. quite like to start the uh, or continue the quest for the ultimate weapon so I can do that now that we got that that we did that um, help Sid out with that problem he had in his cellar uh, let's see if I can find out where we need, what we need to do next to continue with that quest weapon quest. Why do I not find this now? Seem to find it now.
For some reason this guy doesn't seem to have a search option anywhere I can see. Okay, Panda, catch you later. Right, where is this quest? This particular um, guide is not very easy to navigate sometimes. Catch you later, Panda. Right, where is this? Oh, I just can't find it. Oh, here we go. Found it. So we got we got all the letters that we needed. So we got the oracalcum. So we need to take the oracalcum to the legendary smith in Falgabard after opening the door to Eureka. Okay, we haven't opened the door to Eureka yet. So I guess we can't can't do this quest yet anyway right okay I think actually I think I'm going to finish up here because I need to um, try and get my son to go to bed on time and uh, it's easier if I'm not in the middle of a stream um, so tomorrow I will be back in tomorrow tomorrow is the trophy hunter stream I will be playing some um, what am, I, what am I playing? I'm playing Dragon Quest Builders 2 tomorrow. Um, Dragon, Dragon Quest Builders 2. Uh, so, because I've played the game through twice, so I played it through ages ago, and then I played it through again, I, my second playthrough I actually did on, on stream. Um, so because of that, I'm really, really close to the Platinum anyway. I only need one more one more trophy to get for the platinum so um, we should be able to do that tomorrow um, I don't know how long that will take uh, the thing that I need to do is to solve the you get like these puzzles you get on the islands lots of different puzzles you have to solve they're just like mini games um, and you have to do so many of those and then you'll win the trophy so it's possible I could get the trophy really quickly if I do get it really early on then I will probably maybe do um, another playthrough of Erica because we also need one more 
trophy to um, platinum that. So we might possibly get two platinums tomorrow. We'll have to see. Um, right, let me just save the game quickly. And then I can log out of this. Right, there we go. Let's see if there's anyone we can raid. Gubbins, we haven't given Gubbins a raid in ages. He usually finishes before um, before me, so that's usually why. What's he playing? I've not heard of this game before. Let's go and see what that's all about, shall we? And I will finish the Stream Raiders off um, once it's ready. I'll do that off stream. So thanks everyone for hanging out. And yeah, I'll be back tomorrow. So I'll see you all soon. Bye bye now.